In this video, we're going to show you how to adjust or change the pressure settings on a Pearl pressure switch. As always, please follow all safety precautions. We'll begin by removing the cover of the pressure switch. Turn the nut counterclockwise, remove the cover, and flip it over. There you'll notice the settings. In this particular case, the switch is pre-configured to cut on at 30 psi and to cut off at 50 psi. Here we have highlighted the pressure gauge and the switch for easy understanding. Typically, every system works as follows. When the system opens, the pressure begins to decrease until it reaches the cut on, at which point the switch will connect and make the pump start running. Once there is no more demand, the pressure will increase again until it reaches the cut off, causing the switch to disconnect and the pump to turn off. If for any reason you have to change the settings, follow this procedure. Notice there are two springs, one tall one to adjust the range and one short one to adjust the cut off PSI. Normally, you only need to adjust the range. In this specific example, we will move the cut on slash off range from 30 to 50 PSI to 40 to 60 PSI. The steps are as follows. Begin by disconnecting the power. Turn the nut on the tall spring clockwise approximately three full turns. This will vary depending on your installation, pump model, tank, piping, etc. Then reconnect the power and test. You may need to repeat the process several times until you get the correct configuration. If you'd like to change from 40 to 60 PSI to 50 to 70 PSI, just repeat the same procedure shown before. The steps are once more as follows. Begin by disconnecting the power. Turn the nut on the tall spring clockwise approximately three full turns, which will vary depending on your installation, pump model, tank, piping, etc. Reconnect the power and test. You may need to repeat the process several times until you get the correct configuration. If for any reason you need to adjust the cut off PSI and increase the working range of the pressure switch, please do the following. In this particular example, we will move the cutoff and increase the range from 30 to 50 PSI to 30 to 60 PSI. We'll begin by disconnecting the power, then we'll turn the nut on the short spring clockwise approximately three full turns. This will vary depending on your installation, pump model, tank, piping, etc. Connect the power and test. You might need to repeat the process several times until you get the desired configuration. If you have any questions, please contact us at 954 474-9090. Thank you and have a good day.